Hello, good morning. Hi. Welcome back to Vlogmas. It is day three and I just got out of the shower. I did the whole shebang as well as touched up my eyebrows, moisturized and whatnot. And I just changed into long sleeve that I thrifted, but it's from the brand Arizona Jeans, I think from like JCPenney's. I don't know. It was at like a garage sale where they were like fill a bag for a dollar. I've washed it countless times but it still smells a little funny so I don't wear it that often but since I'm doing vlogmas I feel like I can't wear the same hoodie every single day so it's just making me realize I have like no lounge clothes. I don't know what happened, what just happened. Well, I kind of do. I don't know. I just had just a really nice experience, a really nice reading, just a nice connection. And I know I'll see it whenever I sit down to edit the vlog later, but I haven't read my own tarot cards in... pretty much like a year. I haven't run my card since January of this year. Which seeing that is actually heartbreaking. So yeah, this is my first time picking up a deck in pretty much in 11 months, literally. And as soon as I picked up my deck, and like opened the little sleeve thing that is in and like put my hand on the cards like I just felt like my whole entire body get covered in goosebumps and like I'll like I was saying I'll see it whenever I sit down to 
edit this vlog later but I just could feel like a smile on my face like I was just like overcome with this feeling of just like happiness and comfort and just like the feeling that I'm safe and I haven't had that feeling in pretty much a year so just to like experience that feeling again was really nice. Also, yes, I did end up changing shirts just because the smell of the one I was wearing was just getting to me. I've washed it, but it just smelled really funky so I'm gonna throw it in the wash again before I wear it Hello, I've just been sitting here at the kitchen table editing this vlog for the past hour or so and <laughs> I realized that I haven't put outros in any of my <laughs> vlogmases, any of my vlogmas videos. So if I don't film any more tonight, count this as an outro. But it's really interesting filming vlogmas because I've never like daily vlogged before and I'm used to compiling like either like a weekend's worth of content, a few days worth of content, a week's worth of content and getting it all into a video and the vlogs being like 30 to 40 minutes long and it's hard for me to like look at these my vlogs that I'm editing that are like around 10 minutes and I'm like that's really all I did today. One of the main appeals to daily vlogging in general is the people that daily vlog do something interesting every single day like Casey Neistat or whatever. So it's hard to like jump that hurdle like that mental hurdle because it's fine like I would watch this video like I'm okay with the content that I'm putting out I've enjoyed all the videos that I've put out but it's hard to get over the mental hurdle of like oh my gosh my life isn't interesting or it doesn't look as pristine or fantastical as others it's just another one of those like comparison things that I'm working on 